Press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update from Sebastian Fitness Solutions. Let's face it, you clicked on this video, you know what it's about. Heck, you've probably got a tab open in private browsing right now as we speak. It's okay, I won't judge. You're here to know if whether your um, forearm workouts in front of your computer screen affect your muscle gains. And that's exactly what I'm going to be answering in this video. Coming right up. What is up everybody, this is Sunit Sebastian from Sebastian Fitness Solutions coming to you from YFC IC Colony in Burivli. Alright, so let's dive into the hard pressed topic that you've all been asking for and that is, does masturbation affect your gains? Now if you've googled this before, which I'm sure you have, you might have looked into the connection between ejaculation and testosterone. Now if you're unfamiliar with testosterone, it is the male sex hormone which plays a crucial role in the development of male characteristics in the body. The one characteristic, however, that you need to know about is the link of testosterone and its role in building muscle. With high levels of testosterone, your body is better able to build muscle through greater protein synthesis after a hard workout. The belief around the internet is that ejaculation via masturbation and orgasm will cause your testosterone levels to go down to its knees, so to speak, which usually means that your gains will also go flaccid. Well, let's look into what the research says about this. One study showed that short-term abstinence of three weeks or so led to slight raise in testosterone, slight increase in testosterone levels. And another interesting study actually showed that there's a 145.7% spike in testosterone levels at the seven day of abstinence, followed by a sharp drop back to baseline afterwards. However, multiple human and animal studies have shown that ejaculation itself does not acutely affect serum testosterone levels, busting the whole myth that coming would result in your body's testosterone going. Anyway, on top of that, studies show that ejaculation has no detrimental effects on exercise performance. So it doesn't really affect your workout on a physiological level. So it's safe to say that your daily fapping ritual, or if you're lucky, sexy time with your girlfriend, isn't going to affect your gains much, if at all. And while abstinence did see some temporary increase in testosterone, the difference is so insignificant and more importantly, it is not relevant. Which brings me to the most important point I want to discuss with this and that's a very important point to note and that is these short term alterations in your testosterone levels do not matter. Our testosterone levels fluctuate up and down throughout the day by 5, 25 or even as much as 75% especially towards the end of the day and that's normal. In order for testosterone to really affect muscle gains, not only do the levels have to be lower, but they have to be lower by a significant margin and remain that way and remain there for an extended period of time. So, for all intents and purposes, there appears to be no measurable connection between masturbation and strength gain or performance. And if you're purposely abstaining from masturbation or even sex with the intent of increasing testosterone levels to improve your gains, you're really wasting your time and are losing out on some great pleasure probably. But hold up, this does not mean I'm advocating for a free-for-all fab for everybody. You get a fab! You get a fab! Everybody gets fabs! If you're the type that masturbates so frequently that you don't have the time or the energy for the gym, or if you feel that after masturbation, you no longer feel mentally focused or motivated to go to the gym, then masturbation is definitely affecting your gains in that case, although indirectly. So if you fall into this category, then temporary abstinence or at least moderation is something you definitely need to do and need to adopt. Not just for gains, but for daily activities as well, in general. 
there is also a very strong case to completely give up masturbation note not sex and especially porn due to the effects it has on your brain and particularly your dopamine levels but that's a whole another topic altogether if you are interested to know more about this i encourage you to to check out this video that i have on the screen right now the link to which will be in the description which does a great job at explaining it as well as check out the website www.yourbrainonporn.com but all that aside for all you casual wankers i hope this video has given you some relief that your gains are safe so here's wishing all of you scoundrels a very happy fapping just one request make sure you wash your hands before you go to the gym or anywhere else for that matter and that's it guys thank you so much for watching the video give this video a like if you found it informative and share it to help spread my seeds <laughs> lastly hit the subscribe button if you haven't done so already once again thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video But until then keep learning keep growing hey thank you for watching that video don't forget to hit the like button and to subscribe also Head over to the description box below for a link to download my free ebook The 9 Habits to Successfully Build Muscle. Go ahead and grab it. And lastly to watch another video, click right over here.